Hi everyone, welcome to techpex.com. Our today's project is a car parking system which has a limited number of slots and will deny the parking of further cars in case all the slots are filled. Let's have a look at the components that have been used in this project. So first of all we have a breadboard for the assembly of all of the components. Next we have a 16 cross 2 LCD for displaying the status of the slots. Next we have an Arduino Nano as a microcontroller for instructing the components. Here is a servo motor for controlling the movement of the barrier. Next we have reflector sensors for detecting the presence of cars in the slot. Further we have a buzzer for the indication of the filled slots. Next we have connecting wires for connecting all of the components. And lastly we have a power connector. Now let's start constructing this project. So here, first of all I have taken Arduino Nano. Here I have fixed it on the breadboard. Next I'll take an IR reflector sensor. Here the second sensor. And now I'll place the LCD over here. Here is a power connector. This way we will supply the power to the project. Next is the servo motor. Here we are making connections for the power supply to the servo motor. And here it is connected to the microcontroller. Now we will be connecting the IR reflector sensor grounding it, providing it power supply and connecting it to the Arduino Nano. Same goes with the second IR reflector sensor. Here the power supply and grounding of the second IR reflector sensor has been done. So here now we will make connections for the buzzer. Connections for the buzzer are done. Now we will go for the connections of the LCD. So connecting the 4 pins of the LCD. Making the connections on the breadboard here. Power supply, grounding and connections with the microcontroller. So here I am fixing LCD onto its position using a double sided tape. Now we will feed the code to our microcontroller. So here we have already prepared a code and you can see that the code is being supplied to the Arduino Nano so that it may instruct the rest of the components and the project working to be facilitated. Here you can see Arduino parking system is being displayed. Welcome slot left 4. So here we have 4 slots available. Here you can see that the barrier opens as soon as a car is detected by the sensor. Here one car has been parked. Similarly, second car since we have 3 slots left. Now, as soon as the second car has entered, we have two slots left. Here the sensor again detects the presence of the car and the slot left is one now. We are parking another car. Now you can see on the LCD that the slots left are zero. Now if we bring another car over here, so it shows, sorry, parking full. So the entry to the car is denied. So this is how this project works. Now if we remove this car out of here, you can see that the slot left are one. Now if we desire to park the car here, here we can go. 
Now the slots left are zero again. That's it. Don't forget to subscribe our channel to stay tuned with more such projects. Thank you.